Hello guys and girls and welcome back to the next episode of Oxygen Not Included with me, Biffa. Thank you very much for joining me. Oh, we got a little bit of a flood going on. Why is that not dripping out of there? Well, I'll tell you what, let's help this out. Let's mop that up. Maybe another mesh tile under there would help. Let's add one of those in. So, what do we have planned for today? Let me tell you. This is getting quite warm. We've got a lot of natural gas and stuff coming out into this area here. Of course, every time they open the door. Now, we could stop that. There is something we could do to try and stop that coming out there. And I want to give that a try. And then we can sort of get rid of all of this other nasty stuff down here. So we have... Bom, 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 bom. Let's go down here. We have some naphtha down here this liquid naphtha that's where my plastic when it was first made had melted who's getting hot what are you going in there for you nutter don't go through there get out what are they doing you shouldn't be able to get through there that door is now going to be locked so you're gonna have to go the other way and then you're no longer going to be able to get in there with that suit. Anyway, back to what I was talking about. By the way, food's going up again, so that's good. Uh, yeah, this liquid naphtha, and it has an amazing quality. How is that not flooded? I don't know. It has an amazing quality, which we're going to try out and take a look at. So, uh, let's go here, and let's see if we can get this to work. So, what I would like to do is put it in here... Mm, let's see, how shall I do this? If I do... If I do that, first of all... Yeah, that's a nine. Let's just speed things up a bit. Then we'll get rid of this door. And I'll show you what we're going to do. Uh, we also are going to need... A, a bottle emptier. Which we're going to put around that way. Once this door is deconstructed... Yep, food has decayed, food has decayed. I know about the food has decayed. Don't worry about that. There we go, we'll deconstruct that. Um, then we'll grab a bottle emptier. Let's turn that around. Oh, perfect. That will fit in there. And we want to deconstruct that insulated tile as well. There we go. This is going well, by the way. Lots of power. Ah, oh, somebody left me a comment. I'm sorry, I can't remember your name. And I double-checked this on the wiki as well. I had no idea that batteries will slowly lose power over time. So, at the minute, we're filling them up so much, it doesn't really matter. Um, so, let's put this to... Uh, is Naphtha not going to show up on there until we've started mopping it up? Let's have a look. I'll tell you what else I want to mop up is all of this down here as well. This is going to cause problems. So let's... It's going to build up and then mop up. So there we go. Let's mop that up. And then they'll stick it in the bottles and then they'll come and empty it. Yeah, the... Um, yeah, these will lose power slowly over time. So with so... I don't know exactly what that figure is. But with so many batteries, that would explain why when we were sort of on the cusp of... Not enough power, just enough power, we're really close, why aren't things working? It was probably because, I mean, you know, among other things, that these were slowly leaking power over time, which really didn't help. So, come on, I want some naphtha in there. Are you going to come down here and start mopping that up? Not yet. Let's priority nine that. Get that one done. Uh, what's this mopping up down here? Seven, yes, you'll get to that. So I'm not quite sure how much we're going to need. But this naphtha, when you see... I mean, if you don't know already, the amazing ability it has. You've heard of, of locks made with water so you can keep one gas out of another side and uh, one gas not coming through a doorway to another side and that sort of thing. You use, use, um, use a liquid lock or something. It's called something like that. Um, but this naphtha is amazing. And we're going to... I'm going to show you what it does. Cycle 326. In this slot here... So the dupes can still pass, but it will stop all this natural gas coming out. How is our... Oh, look, we're making so much oxygen. Now power's not a problem. That's good. Um, yeah, they're automatically off anyway. That one should be automatically off anyway. Activate if lower than... Let's just put 750 on those, and they'll mostly stay off. Otherwise, they're coming on and off all the time. There we go. I uh, just want to make sure that this hasn't got everything selected. Ah, oh, Naphtha's on the list. Right, here we go. Naphtha. Let's put a priority nine on that. 
It's a shame all of it's coming out here. I don't know what. Well, how much pressure is in here? 1,300. Oh, there's a lot of pressure behind here. Not as much pressure here. That's why the natural gas is all coming out. We'll deal with that. But anyway, let's see. Uh, let me get them to sweep up this stuff that's down here. Come on, when you're ready. Right, the naphtha has been delivered. There we go. So that's going to start pouring into this hole. I'm hoping we've got enough. So there's some. What have we got down there? Naphtha liquid, 35.4 kilograms. Well, that's not... Let's have a look. Let's go down here. Oh, do you know what? There isn't enough here. Look. Water, water. I'm not quite sure what that one is. Water. We need more naphtha. Okay, well, that's fine. So let us enable that. That's going to go on a nine. That's going to work anyway. This is going to go disabled. If I disable that, is it going to drop out all the plastic? No. Good. And we want that enabled as well. Got to do that. What have we got down here? Crude oil. Okay, there we go. So I want that to hop out onto the floor. Of course, yeah, this machine makes water, doesn't it? I think that's what it is. Uh, steam. Steam. There we go. Well, that's going to pop onto the floor. That plastic. And that will melt. Hardness 1. Very soft. Melting point 76.9. What's the temperature around it? 84. So any second now. There we go. It's heating up. 69. 70. What is any naphtha down here? I haven't thought of that. Liquid... Looks like that's the water. Yeah, because of the prop property that we spoke about. There we go. 73, 74. Man, some people are getting stressed. Don't get stressed. Go and have a massage. 75. Almost there. You can do it. 75.8. Oh, it's going rather slow now. now what's the temperature down here? 78. See, if I had a... That's where the steam is. I was just thinking if I could put a chest with the naphtha, uh, with the plastic in and just dump it out somewhere. Yeah, that's all water. 75.8, 75.9, that's going to 76. It's getting there. 76.3, come on. <laughs> I want to see it turn into naphtha. It's getting there, 76.7. There's a load more steam. What's this? Naphtha, there we go. Excellent. So if we mop that up as well, there we go, they'll get to that and they'll make a load of that. So we'll make a load of naphtha to be put into here when they wake up. Food is decayed, but we've got lots of food, so that's fine. What have we got? Meal lice, lice loaf. Okay, we're going to take off of here meal lice. Because we do have 50 lice loaf and some mush bars. So I'm going to just change that one back to that one. There we go. Excellent. Right. Is anyone coming? I'm having to pause when I move around. There we go. Yep, they've done it. Because of the frame rate. Now we're so far into the game. And there's so much stuff going on. Okay, that, that's starting to get hot over here. 86, 87. Oh, there we go. Naphtha's going in. Excellent. You'll start noticing what it does once we get past the lip here. So it looks like it's going to take a while, unfortunately. I thought it was going to go through quite quickly, but... I'm wondering whether if we didn't have this block here, actually, whether it would still work. It probably would, you know. I probably made a mistake by adding in... If I pop that there... We didn't actually need that block, which you'll see. I don't know why I... I uh, we didn't need that hole. So put in the block there. Hopefully that will just get displaced up above. Yeah, there we go. So we've got 169.9 kilograms. Nowhere near enough. But can you see what it's doing? You see how it's acting? It's not spreading out. Let's go down here. See if we've got some more. Okay, we've got more plastic. Let's get them just to mop up. Whatever comes out. Oh, there we go. The stress has gone down. Excellent. Food's going up. That's what we like to see. 75.2. I wonder whether we just dump this out as well, just to get a load. Because I think we're actually going to need quite a bit of this. Hmm. Um, let's. 
<laughs> Let's dump it out and get a load. We know we can make more if we need to. Overheat damage, yeah, okay. Don't pick up the plastic. So I'm hoping they're not going to store that anywhere else. Yeah, there you go. You fix that for me. What is that made out of? Gold. Oh, man. It must be getting pretty hot here then. It is. That's just what we want to see. 75.9. Yeah, that's going to take a while over there. Well, we'll come back and look at that. It's taken a while. Maybe I should have made the nap for first before I uh, took the door away. But that's okay. The oxygen pressure that we've got here, look, it's pushing all of this down. Uh, we do need to sort of deal with this natural gas. Um, it's going to sit between the carbon dioxide and the oxygen. So this sort of spot here. So actually, if we put in a temporary pump, uh, gas pump right there. And a wire. Let's see. Can we grab off of one of these? Circuit status zero from 720. Why is that one zero? Where's that going? Oh, okay. That's all the massaging and stuff. Yeah, we'll just grab a wire off of there. Um, and then we'll pump that out. And we sort of want to filter this a bit. So actually, if we go that way... Gas filter in there. How should we do this? What I want to do is filter out. Let's do it. Oh dear. Let's do it this way. Yeah, change my mind. Let's do it that way. Uh, I want to filter out the natural gas. So that's going to be basically this. And send it down here. And just stick it into there. So if I go... Oh, actually, if I just connect it up to there. I'm hoping that won't mess this up. No, it shouldn't do, should it? And then everything else can just get vented back into this area again. I mean, what sort of stuff are we likely to get? Uh, let's put all of that on an 8. And that on an 8. Let's just check. There we go. This is only a temporary thing. We're just to clear this up until we've got our... I'll nap the thing sorted. There we go. Oh, it's pumping already. Uh, let's send out natural gas. Uh, we're likely to pick up some polluted oxygen, some oxygen. Yeah, I might just stick it back through into here again, just so it's out of the way. Um, so we'll have that just come into there. And we'll stick a high pressure thing on it, just to make sure there isn't any problems. Good. Okay, we'll go with that. That will do for now. And that will start clearing out all this natural gas. What have we got in there? Yeah, there's a few bits and pieces. There's not much. Oh, somebody's... Oh, it's moved. Oh, okay. I'll take it back. We are going to need that tile removed to stick it in there. Because it seems to have moved over, which is a bit odd. Oh, that needs power as well, doesn't it? Yeah, we can just grab some power from there. How's this wire? 120 out of potential 240. Man, that wire's doing nothing. Oh, it's only running off of two of those. Huh, okay. Let's do it off of this one then. Just in case there's a sudden need for massaging. Unreachable build. There we go. Good, you'll be able to reach that. Excellent, there we go. So if we mop this naphtha up now, they will pop it back in the hole again. Too much liquid. No, what? Oh, for goodness sake. Um. Oh, man, seriously? How am I going to move that then? Oh, flipping it, that's annoying. I mean, we could just put the door thing here that I'm working on instead, but I really wanted it in there. <laughs> we might have to just avoid that... Uh, that Naphtha there. What else have we got down here? Naphtha. Yeah, there's some down here. Yeah, I'm going to get them to drop it in the hole and we'll just forget about the rest. Oh, flipping annoying. I, I, I don't know why it travelled along like that. That is weird. That is very weird. What's the matter with you? No gas intake. What are you talking about? You're talking about no gas intake. Well, you know, that would make sense as you actually have no gas intake. There we go. Thank you very much. 
There we go. We've got some more. Oh, maybe... Too much liquid. Oh, that's annoying. If it comes up and touches that, I don't want it to sort of move and mess around. I mean, if I got rid of that, it would fall down. But the likelihood of it spreading out is sort of slim to none. So, yeah. Oh, there we go. That one's going. Excellent. There we go. A little bit of oxygen, some CO2, whatever. Poisonous stuff. But that'll go into here. Yep, that's fine. Keep all those going. Here it comes. Nice. Good, good, good. So that'll help with that. Seems like we're still not getting quite enough in here with those three, which is weird, you know. I mean, let's have a quick look up here again. How's this going up here? Yeah, I mean, that's not going too bad, is it? Not too cold that it's causing problems. And how's all this going? Yeah, this is going fine. They're picking it up, delivering it there. Oh, good. Oh, we'll leave that going. Uh, let's have a look at our food. Ah, oh, this is nicely cooled down. Look at that. We've insulated this water over to there. And we've made it out of abyssalite. So it really isn't going to heat up as much as it was. Excellent. There's a bit of heat in there, but this is all keeping okay. And that's all growing nicely. What's the matter with that one? Seriously, you're right next to a wheeze wart. How on earth can you be too hot? Are you too cold? Temperature 10 to 30. And it's 7.9. Oh, okay. Well, I'll tell you what we could probably do now is deconstruct that. We probably don't need that anymore. Because like we've seen before, the temperature of the auction that's coming in is at 9 anyway. 10. By the time it gets down here, it's 10 degrees. And what's it coming out there at? 9 degrees. Yeah, so if we deconstruct that, so we'll stick that in the base somewhere instead. And we'll just stick another food thing here, just to... There we go. Just because, why not? And then we can use that wheeze wart somewhere else where it's quite warm. What's the gas pipe content? Still 39 degrees. Did you maybe put it here? Or just use it in our base to cool down an area? Um, maybe next to this. But that is getting pretty hot. That's nearly 100 degrees. Oh my goodness. Yeah, let's stick it here. I'm not sure it's going to have much luck. But we'll, we'll see. There we go. How's that looking now? Some more natural gas down there. There's a lot down here. We may need to just stick another pump over here. Yeah, we'll leave that one going for a while. How's the naphtha going? Oh, that's gone. It's gone into here now. Excellent. Unless it's fallen down. It has. The naphtha's moved. Still too much liquid. Look. That is strange. That is strange. Well, anyway, it's going to end up in there. I want that to be on a 9. Let's just see how this is going down here. Is it melted again? Uh, oh, man. It's taking so long to melt. 51.7. Well, looks like that'll be an ongoing project. Unless there's any sort of naphtha in here. Water, water, water. No, I'm going to get them to mop this up anyway, just in case. Just in case there's any hidden in there. Oh, man. What's that one? Oh, that's got... Uh, I'm confused. Oh, I see. No, I'm not confused. Hmm. Why don't I just pump it out into this section rather than... Why is that not working? Considering all the CO2 that's in here. Oh, it's got no water coming in, has it? Um, and is that wastewater connected up still to anything? That will be going up to there. That will be going over to there. Yes, it is. Okay, maybe we just need to connect this straight to this. 
and not have the pump doing it. What are we filtering out? Natural gas. Oh, of course. Well, where is the natural gas going? That's going up into here, but there isn't any. Okay, that needs to change. Let's deconstruct that. Let's put a heavy doobie doo one in there. High pressure, you know the things I mean. Just to keep that going. Because at the minute that's stopping because that's not outputting. I mean, that isn't pumping quick enough, is it? Look what's in. Well, it's not that much in there, but. We need this going constantly to get that really hot. I'm just wondering whether we could transport our plastic somewhere else. Just so we could drop it out and get it to melt. 76.9. 71, 70, 70, five, uh, no, 500, 500 degrees, no, 20, 225, and you've got to get pretty low, 82, so somewhere down here, we could just stick a chest with our plastic in, 79.8, actually this is quite hot. Thing is, we haven't got any ladders. We've got a ladder there. I'm just trying to find a place that's near ladders that we've already got. 70, 70. Uh, maybe we'll just leave that there and, and wait for it. Oh, there we go. Look, let's add in the high pressure valve. There we go. So that can do its job. Or maybe we can just dig down through here. Just like here. 84 degrees. Hmm. Trying to find a way of doing it without letting out a load of gas or causing any other problems or anything. Yeah, I mean, we could do it, couldn't we? I mean, if we dig through here, what have we got? Polluted water. I mean, we've got to get in there anyway. So, yeah, let's open this up. And then we could go down here. And just speed it up a bit like that. Naphtha. More naphtha. Mop it up. Mop up the naphtha. There we go. Excellent. Thank you very much. Oh, is that door locked? No, it can get through. Okay, let's go and check what's happening. Okay, what have we got in there? Still 6.1 kilograms. Man, it's going to take ages. And that's still unmoppable. Oh yeah, let's put this in here. Plant that in there and have that make absolutely no difference at all. What are we up to now? Temperature wise. 89, 90. So I think it, it, it's heating up obviously when it's being used. And then the small break that it gets in between. It cools down. I have actually put this down to an 8 priority now. Because we are backing up with the stuff. I may even drop it down to a 7. And as long as that keeps backed up and keeps up with the power, we should be okay. Hopefully. Yeah, food. Nice. Everything's looking good. Is that more? Can't see what it is. Water, water. Well, we're mopping anyway. Have a constant mop. There should be a way to set a always mop in this area command. So if we deliberately had water, like I'm doing, I deliberately want stuff mopped up. That is open, isn't it? Yeah. Can you come and do that? Construction task assigned. Okay. I mean, we're going to lose a bit of that oil, but that's fine. We've got a lot. So what I will do is... We'll just carry on down here until we get to a place. 81. There we go. 79... Let's go all the way down. I mean, they're going to get really hot. But let's go down to, like, here. And just stick it there. Maybe one up. We don't want it... I don't think we're going to have enough in there that's going to break a hole in the floor or anything. But we'll go with that. There. Is that hotter one over? Get off the screen. 82. 83. We're going to pop it there and then they can mop it up from that section. How about that? 
Well, it says construction task assigned. Oh, there we go. Opening some damage. What have we got? Yeah, that's. Where's that water? Water. Fix that up. It's working. As long as there's a load of plastic lying on the floor. We probably didn't need to pop this plastic out, to be honest. But that's not heating up anyway, so we'll leave this going. Oh man, they're so blooming slow building things. What are you going to do? Hope you're going to come and say, wouldn't build this while you're down here. Everybody can get through. It's open. Let's just put that on fire, it doesn't need to be anymore. Construction task assigned. Awaiting delivery of granite. Ah, oh, okay. Who's it assigned to? Oh, there we go. Camille. Whoa! It's not that much crude oil, but why is it all suddenly shooting up here? Whoa! Is this going to suddenly kick off? It wasn't going off before, was it? It shouldn't do anyway, because we haven't got the thing on it. Tapping the... Maybe that's just... A... No, it's not. It's just gone down. Yeah, I think it's just the different liquids affecting each other. Okay. As long as you don't lose, lose any naphtha down there, I'm fine with that. And it does seem to be staying there. Okay, let's have a quick look up here see how we're doing. Oh, 27.1 kilograms. Right, okay, we've got some more. Well, let's have a look at the tent. Look at the heat of that. Good grief. Let's see, how's that going? Well, that's heating that up. <laughs> the wheeze wart's getting hot. Oil refinery, 82. Yeah, I don't know whether that's going to help, but we'll... Oh, I know what's not helping here. Look, that water is dripping straight through. It's not... Oh, we've discussed this before, haven't we? That's why I've got these alternated. It only calls if it hits a tile and runs through like that on, on a surface and then drips. But because we've taken out that middle floor, it's running along, dripping straight through and then hitting there and calling these. So this isn't actually getting called by this. Um, okay. 100. Nice loaf. Excellent. So what is going to be an easy way to swap that? Because if I change that, it means I need to change that and change that. Um, can I fit any tiles above here? So I've got space there to put some tiles in. But that... Oh, I can actually put some tiles on there as well, can I? No, I can't. Oh, that is annoying. I mean, I could just... Leave that one there and just replace... Yeah, let's just do that. Let's deconstruct that. That's an easy fix, isn't it? And then at least this water here will hit this block. There we go. And then it'll run either side and... Yeah, that'll do. And that will help to cool that off, perhaps. Good. How are we doing here? Still 27.1. Damage overheated. Yeah, well, that'll get fixed, won't it? Oh, there's some more stuff. Oh, look, there we go. An instant change. We're down to 59, 60. Let's just see. Was this still backing up here? No, it wasn't. So it seems like we've still got plenty of power. So having that on 7 is working okay. Even though it's not backing up the petroleum, the power's still there. So we can keep an eye on that. We can balance that as we need it. Oh, 57.1 kilograms of naphtha. We're getting there. What's the temperature? 63. Yeah, that's much better. So actually, that there, we're not going to have that there. We're going to have that in here somewhere. Um, I mean, here would be nice to <laughs> cool all this down, but... What temperature is in here? 36. No, it doesn't really matter, does it? This is all okay. Oh, there we go. Let's add... Copy that into there. There we go. Thank you. Probably down here. Although this isn't working as well, this side, is it? This is all 30, 32, 34. This is 19. Oh, where's the oxygen actually coming for this one? So what's this coming through here? That is coming through at 39. Oh, no wonder that's causing problems. But this is the one that's coming through at 11. Yeah, we want to change that, don't we? We want that one to run down there and come out down here. So we're going to disconnect that. 
and we're going to go not liquid pipe, gas pipe. There we go. And this isn't used that much, so hopefully that won't. We've got so much oxygen up here. Spreading it around a bit isn't really going to make much of a difference, is it? And that will come out cooler. And that will hopefully cool that corner down. Um, what's that coming down there? That's 39 as well. So this has just managed to stay cool all on its own. With just this in here, I think. So what we could do, perhaps, is take this out. And take that one out. And take that one out. And let's put that one there and that one there. There we go. Just change things around a little bit here. There we go. And in there we're going to have one of those. And in there we're going to have one of those. Just see if we can't get this cooled down a bit more. There we go. Excellent. And I might just deconstruct that. And deconstruct that. Don't need it. Yep, deconstruct that. Excellent. Okay, what's overheating? This thing down here. Well, we know about that. Anything more to mop? Yeah. Water, water, water. Oh, I've just realised something that isn't helping is I have nowhere at the moment to store polluted dirt and stuff. So, we need to deal with that. And we're going to pop it in the middle here. And we're going to stick one of these in there as well. There we go. These are our two storages, and they're full. Plant another one. I've got one going in here, have we? Plant, just please. There we go. So if we copy what's in there. There we go. What's that on? That's on a seven. Let's put that on a seven as well. There we go. And now they should start picking up all of this stuff, which is probably not helping. Polluted oxygen... Whether that affects fridges, why it would, I don't know. But if it does, then there's that. Um, can I put in here something to deal with all the polluted oxygen? Or will it just go anyway? Probably not. There's not too much in there. Oxygen, oxygen, pollution. Yeah, it's not that much. There's a little bit bobbing around. Yeah, we won't worry too much about that. Oh, update on the naphtha. 57.1 kilograms in there. Still need more. Yeah, I've been trying a little bit of experiment with this naphtha down here that says there's too much liquid um, for it to be mopped up. And it, it doesn't spread out at all, which is one of the properties that I like about it. But... It means if you get it in the wrong place and there's too much of it, you sort of seem to be a bit stuffed. <laughs> there's no way of picking it up or mopping it. So, if you're going to do what I'm doing, you've really got to keep an eye on how much there is. And make sure it doesn't get out of hand and there's too much to work with. Uh, I'm just changing things around in here a bit as well. I just want to put in... There we go. Something like that that's just going to lock off this area here. There we go. Hopefully you can still get through there. You should be able to. If not, we'll just dig that one out. I just want to close this section in. Can I mop that? Probably not. Too much liquid. Uh, just close this in in case anything decides to happen. And also we're getting all sorts of stuff mixed in here as well, which isn't very good. That's it. You mop. Leave your hat on, please. That would be a better idea. Right, it seems like for what I want to do, we, le we need a heck of a lot of naphtha and it just isn't this isn't melting uh, we're just not making it quick enough with this machine so i'm going to move all of this into here and then dump it out over here instead because the temperature over here is 68 is right next to that which is hotter what's this down here 63 yeah just for now until we get um this built which they're taking flipping ages to do i think that would be a good idea the only other thing i just thought is What's that? 57, 62. Yeah, have we done it before we cooled this thing down? <laughs> that probably would have worked a bit better. But hey-ho, never mind. I don't want to start spreading the naphtha all over the place. So, so I'm going to come down and build that for me. 
Okay, somebody's built it. They've moved all the plastic, I think. So if I now, there we go, dump out the plastic and disable that, we should get a lot more happening over here, naphtha-wise. There we go. So that's back there. That's a lot hotter. Okay, we'll see how that goes. I've got to keep an eye on it, though, because what I don't want is too much naphtha, and then I can't mop it up. That'd be, that'd be nuts. Uh, let's see. How's this going? Oh, it's building up. 124.6 kilograms. We're getting there. We're getting there. And I move this down here as well to try and get rid of some of this. Uh, what have we got? Carbon, natural gas, natural gas. We've got a little bit flowing out, but nothing too bad. That's probably not much going through there. Ah, uh, little bits and pieces. Okay. Well, it turns out this wasn't a good idea. Yes. Hands up all the people that probably could have told me that. I tell you what I'm going to do is I'm going to move one of these down to here. Um, yeah. And just see if we can change that around a bit. Because that is not working very well, is it? Um, do we need... Yeah, we don't really need to worry about keeping the heat in there. So, let's do that. And we'll deconstruct those. And I'll probably move the middle one out. Oh, I can't stick a wart seed in there. Maybe just not having three crammed in such a small area will help. I'm just wondering whether... This is nice cool air coming through here. Whether we could run a pipe down. Actually, if we take that end one out, run one of these pipes down to here just to let some of that air in there because we've got so much air. Just to maybe keep that a bit cooler. That might be a good idea. Yeah, let's let's try that. Uh, what am I looking for? Power. Power transformer made out of gold. We'll stick that one. Yeah, we'll stick it in the middle. You can come and finish off this for me. That would be fantastic. There we go. 48. Done. And then the power for this one goes to all of those. So if we just remove that and add the wire going up there. Where's that coming in? Oh yeah, that can come in down there, can't it? So let's deconstruct that. I've got this closed off because we've probably got some chlorine in there which we don't really want going everywhere as I open up the wall of course. There we go. We'll do that. There we go. We'll do that. We'll do that. That's it. And then we'll run that up to there. And then we'll get rid of that one. Deconstruct those wires. That should be okay. Who's scalding? Oh, you're scalding. Going into there, aren't you? Oh, don't go into there. It's not a good idea. It's hot. Um, and then let's have some gas pipes. Where should we split it? We could split it here. Let's have a look at our oxygen. I probably want to split it after the farms. So that will split first. And it goes down there. It's not going to make a huge amount of difference. We're just going to go like that. Thank you. And a gas vent there. Yeah. There we go. If you can do that for me. Thank you very much. We're waiting for iron ore. We have lots of iron ore. How's the naphtha coming? Oh my giddy aunt. It takes so flipping long. 321.1 kilograms of naphtha. How's this going down here? After digging this hole down here, it's probably going to be a complete waste of time because we're managing to... We are managing to make our naphtha. Slowly but surely. What have we got there? 3,680 kilograms of plastic. So... It gets there. See, every time it makes one, it's like the previous one will then melt. And there's a lot to be picked up as well. So... We get all these on nines. So they'll get on with that. Yay, and our other farm's nice and cool as well. Excellent. Just what we wanted. How's this going up over here? No power. Why the heck not? Oh, we got that one wire that you can't get to. You can get to it over this way. Yeah, if you come through the top here, these doors are open. Yep, yeah, yep, yeah, and yep. Yeah. So feel free to run round and do that for me. What do you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to cancel that. I'm going to make it out of gold. Because I know that there's gold readily available without messing around. 
Unfortunately, there's nothing in any of those. We're not losing any food. Lice left. Oh, so many meal lice. Fantastic. There we go. It's done. Hopefully, what's that coming through at? 13 degrees. That'll start cooling that area down a bit. Should be okay. I believe these are. These were made out of gold. Yeah, they're made out of gold. Building broken. Where's that? Oh, man. That's getting rather hot in there. Okay, well. Not much I can do about that. Mop it all up. Right, I'm also looking at this area here. We're just not quite keeping up with our polluted water. Um, but we could do with more water. And there's plenty of places that could do with more water. I'm thinking of another one of these uh, up here. Um, but it means sort of messing around with some of this floor and stuff like that. So if I deconstruct some of these things and see what we can do... There we go. And we'll add in... So if we have the two blocks there, and then we'll have the mesh tiles on either side. Like that, and... Like that, and like that, and like that. Yep, there we go, we'll do that. And they can get up here, they can get in yet there. Yeah, that's all fine. So then if we get rid of these... Construct. How big is that? One, two, three tiles high. Yeah, I thought so. So deconstruct that. Oh, we've done it already. We'll do the same over here. And then I'm going to have to move around some of these pipes a bit as well. Yeah, because they're in the way. So let's grab a water distiller. Yeah, it doesn't quite fit in the middle there, does it? So let's see. If we... Uh, so basically that needs to come out, go up there and join up to there again. So if we just deconstruct that, that should actually be okay, shouldn't it? And then we can just move it over one to here and have it go around. Then we can have that one connect up. Where's that one going? Oh yeah, that one's going over there. Yeah, hopefully this doesn't start getting herky-jerky like it normally does when it all gets a bit confused about stuff. Thank you, and thank you. Okay, now that you're awake, if you would be so kind. Thank you very much. And then build those for me. Yes, that can go in there. Like that. And then... Bum, 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 bum. What am I looking for? Plumbing. Insulated. That can come out and just join that. Uh, this one here... Go in there as well. Yeah. That should be okay. Hopefully. Let's just see how that works. Uh, oh, yeah. That needs a connector there, doesn't it? There we go. And just as we're working on getting this filled up, we're lapping the bottom <laughs> of the tiles here. That's how close we are. Oh, my goodness me. Uh, does that need power? Yes, it does. Can I take power off of there? Potential power, one, no, not off of that one. Yes, we'll take it off of this one here. There we go. Thank you very much. Let's come straight down there. What are you all waiting for? All right, there seems to be something wrong with waiting for iron ore. I don't know where my iron ore is all stored, but... Whenever I make something with iron, even though we've got 10.7 tons of it, it never actually seems to be... I mean, there's iron, there's iron, there's iron. Have I locked a door somewhere? No. You can get in and out of there. So how many... What is that? Iron. That's like 800... Not much. 40, uh, 800. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know what it is. But it's always the same. If I'm making something out of iron... There we go. They're, they're doing it now. Good grief. Right. Up, nap for update. Still lots of naphtha. Not as much as we need. <laughs> okay, changed it to gold. They never seem to get enough iron. Good grief. So what is this on? That's on a nine. I'm going to put that on... No, we don't want them both on a nine. Let's put them on an eight. Just to get them going a bit to get rid of some of this. And we really could do with more water. So let's see. That's going up. That's joining up. That's shooting left or right. That's fine. 
and then that's going up as well once that starts going that's coming round into there for some reason an insulated pipe don't ask me why and i also noticed that i'd accidentally connected those electrical wires together so we're over the top of that nap for update 425.6 kilograms just while we're uh, going through the night here building broken gas pipe oh okay broken frozen pipe contents what seriously oh come on you're having a laugh you're having a giraffe seriously there's like nothing cold down this neck of the woods anyway what i was gonna say i want to mop thank you what i was gonna say was while we're waiting for these people to do this if you've never tried out debug mode oh look people are leaving helmets down here let's request an exosuit into there is there any other helmets lying around uh if you've never used debug mode i'll try and remember to put a link in the description below oh there we go they're all full up uh, if not, I'm going to make that nine just to get it going. It's like never going to start. If not, Google it. Debug mode option not included. One of the cool things you can do. Look, they're taking them off. Stop taking your hats off. Nutters. Oh, there we go. It's working now. Hang on. I'll get back to debug mode in a second. Yep, that's working. That's going out. Joining me with that going up. Hopefully that will start dealing with that. Is you can press Alt F1 and you get a no gui version of your map you can have a look uh, you can also zoom out like this there we go ignore this sort of graphical glitch over there you're not supposed to be able to zoom out this far get a really cool overlay doesn't it make you feel like the guys that live here are just ants living in an ant's nest <laughs> but it gives you like a sense of how big the map is i mean that's the end there i don't know how far over uh it's going this way let's turn that off and go back in again how far can we go? Uh, won't let us go any further than that. Whether that's the edge of the map or not, I don't know. But that's cool. Uh, also, you can have a little cheat and see what other biomes are there. If you press backspace on your keyboard, I'm not going to do it because I don't want to spoil my playthrough here. But that will just open up the whole map for you. So that's something else you can do. Um, and also, if you press backspace, it'll open up all the map. It'll give you a another little menu will pop up on the right-hand side here. Where you can basically... It's what you see people like Brothgar using. Unreachable bed. Who has got themselves trapped somewhere? Gene is not an unreachable bed, Janana. Do you know, I might as well cancel that. <laughs> it's just taking so long for them to do that. Let's forget it and just stick with this. Um, it's what you see Brothgar using when he does what I would call creative building. Like, you know, along the lines of creative building like in Minecraft. Where you just get the blocks and just build the things without having to mine them and stuff. That gives you that menu as well. So if you want to do that, that's how you do it. What sort of slows down stuff down here is the lack of oxygen going into these things. It takes so much oxygen to fill them up sometimes. Never mind. Right. Too much liquid. Scalding. Where's that? What a surprise. That's over here. Oh man, these are boiling, aren't they? I think we should have maybe not left this so insulated i don't think that's helping our oxygen's coming in and cooling things down a little bit but we're getting overheat damage in here now darn it um yeah that wasn't a good idea at all was it that really wasn't we could do with some water yeah look things are breaking we could do with a couple of warts in there i'm wondering whether we could just steal steal a couple um, like this one here. We uproot that and just stick that right in the middle. Mm, flower pot. Oh, we can't, can we? It's not big enough. Ah! Um, or oh, the other thing was is to put in airflow tiles and let this cold air move around at least between these areas here. So if we do that and that, that cool air coming in. Yeah. Anyway, we'll see how that goes. Hopefully all of our food doesn't disappear. That wouldn't be good at all. <laughs> Just a little update. I've put a block there, which some of you may have already mentioned in the comments, because the uh, dupes can still jump down and get through there. But it means we're not going to need as much naphtha to uh, build up to the top here. So, yep. 
Nap for updates, 450 kilograms. Ah, oh, the time has come. We've actually run out of oil, which is where we're getting most of our power from. Ah, oh, I hadn't noticed it. No. We've got a little bit left down here, but we need to super get on building this oil reservoir and get that working. There might be... I'm just looking around. Is there something... What have we got in here? A couple of thousand odd over there. We've got another one there. Yeah, I think we need to do that. Um, I was really hoping to get this Naphtha airlock thing finished in this episode. But everything has been taking so long. Um, yeah, but you get the idea. That is going to flow up and hit that. And stop the air passing one to the other. It may even be stopping it already. Carbon dioxide, natural gas. Possibly. Yeah, that natural gas isn't getting over here. So it may be that it's stopping it going through already. But we are now out of power. So next episode, frantic, trying to sort out this before we completely run out of power. <laughs> if you want to see that, hit the big B with the tea stain on. Don't forget to leave a like if you enjoyed it as well. And I will see you then. Take care. Bye-bye.